It's uh, 6 45 in the morning and I'm in Florida and I'm asking myself what the heck am I doing up at 6 45 in the morning? Well guess what? It's iCast day. Uh, iCast was yesterday, the first day, so there's a lot of stuff been released. Most of, well, everything's been released. But I get the opportunity to go today. Flew in yesterday, Misty and I are here on vacation. We planned the vacation around iCast, so I'm gonna go up and check out some of the new stuff. And we're bring to you guys some of my favorite stuff that I see at iCast on this video. So stay tuned. A bunch of stuff from Shimano, some do-it stuff, Yolotech, uh, and any other cool thing that I see at iCast is going to be on this video. So let's do it. You gotta get your arms way up in a cat and set the hook on a small mouth pass and then you'll understand. You gotta get your hands on a Shimano reel. Energy lumens right, I'll bet you like what you feel. Step on the deck, give it a whirl. Hello, welcome to my world. new for Shimano this year is a Corrado DC 200 it's the uh, same platform I've been used to with the uh, the DC except it's going to be in a 200 frame it's normally a 150 frame spool is going to be a little bigger it's going to hold a little bit more line Also new for Shimano this year is a, an SLX rod line. A ton of different options, really cool. Um, got the spiral X wrap that you're normally used to in Shimano. Doesn't have a monocoque handle on it like the new Zodius or the Poison Adrena. Really cool, I like the blue. There's a giant, I guess this is probably a swim bait rod. It's a 7.8. Lure rating two to eight ounces. Sunrise on a Saturday, I'm headed down to the lake, just my buddy and me. Got my boat hooked up to my Chevy truck, I'm running high on luck, I ain't ever coming down. Time to back the boat down. Oh, 
Talk to some fellas, uh, Trevor actually, one guy, Trevor from uh, ProGuide Batteries today, ProGuide, ProGuide Lithium Batteries. Um, basically the same price point as most other lithiums, but I had a pretty good conversation with him talking about, um, you know, telling him that I was kind of in the market for some lithium batteries. And to answer the age old question for me, should I go with three 12 volt lithium batteries or one 36 volt? Uh, and he says that that's a question that a lot of anglers or a lot of people that are using their batteries have in common and that is which one do you buy do you buy three 12 volt batteries or do you buy one 36 volt for a trolling motor is what i'm what i'm referring to and he said it kind of all depends on your fishing style fishing style means that if you're beating the banks up and you have your trolling motor to 80 and 90 percent of the maximum power all day and you're really ripping down the bank the 36 volt is not going to be way to go however you know if you're just fishing leisurely, leisurely uh, and you're not you know you can stay on the trolling motor all day but you know in that 50 percent range of power down to lower than that if you can pull that off then one 36 volt battery actually would suffice for you which is really cool so got his contact information appreciate his time got to see alex rudd a few of the people out there that all kind of pros there but pretty cool deal showed you to do it stuff all right guys, just finished up my uh, iCast tour through there. Showed you guys some stuff here. The coolest thing that I saw today, um, well, not the coolest thing, but I saw a lot of cool things. The um, the new Shimano stuff's obviously awesome. 200 series, looking at the um, Crowder DC. Uh, they also have the Miravel, which is gonna be a cool price point, about $129, which has the Magnum light rotor and stuff that you're not normally used to in that price point, which is gonna be pretty cool cross carbon drag uh, it also has uh, Hagani gearing um, pretty cool reel for 129 bucks so again I didn't get any footage of that because there's so many people around it uh, again the Shimano uh, 200 series in the Corrado K I'm sorry the Corrado DC which is similar to the Corrado K it's 200 series um, just a bigger uh, bigger reel bigger uh, reel spool bigger reel frame uh, the overboard thing that I showed you there, that was uh, a table that's above the Yeti cooler or any other cooler really, but pretty cool design there. I can see myself using that, especially uh, in, you know, just, in, you know, pleasure times. But uh, 
pretty cool deal. I cast 2022 in the books.